Um, so now we will be discussing about the programming with functions in Python. So this is an activity. So what's the purpose? So prove that you can write a Python program that calls functions and methods to get the current date and to append values to a text file. Meaning we will need to create a Python program and put the values to the text file. So problem statement. So many companies wish to understand the needs and wants of their customers more deeply so the company can create products that fill those needs and wants. One way to understand customers more deeply is to record the values entered by the customers while they are using the program and then to analyze those values. One common way to record values is for a program to store them in a file. So we will be using the text file. So the activity or the assignment is so the previous lessons prove milestone required you to write a program named tire volume that py so we discussed it a while ago and i also have the tutorial for that then that computes the approximate value of air inside the tire add code near the end of that program that does the following so this step should have should be in our code so first is we get the current date from the computer's operating system so how do you how do we get that code so basically we we just need to have the date time next is open a text file name volume that text for appending so appending means we need to put the data into the text file next is append to the end of the volume text file once one line of text that contains the following five values current date width of the compute width of the tire aspect ratio of the tire diameter of the wheel volume of the tire so here is the example okay so when we run the code using the input shown below, ensure that your program output matches the output shown below. So it should be 185, 50, 14, then the output should be 24.9 liters. Also, in our volume that text, we need to open the VS code and verify that the last line of text in the file looks like this, except that it will be different. So this one. So this will be what our text file should show. The next is run your program using the input shown below. Then we just need to run the program again so that the last line will append the new data. So this we will write this code now. So we will use the Visual Studio code. So we have the third volume that py volume that text. So to append the data. So first we need to import math. We need to import the math library. Next is we need to import date time to get the date and time today from our computer. Then we need to prompt user user for input. Then tire width for the width of the tire. So we need to declare it as integer input. Enter the width of the tire tire in mm millimeter <coughs> sample is to 5 so this is what looks like in our program there let's check so let's check so this one so next is we should ask the user to enter the aspect ratio and the diameter okay continue to code Tire width next is the aspect ratio equals integer input enter the aspect ratio of the tire example is 60 okay Next will be we will need to ask the user for the wheel diameter equals integer input then enter the diameter of the wheel in inches so we need the inches example is 15 okay next is we will calculate the volume so we have the formula tire underscore volume 
so we will need to use the tar volume as our um, variable to get the result or to get the uh, calculate the volume so we need the math that py to get the pi times the tire width then times 2 then times the aspect ratio then we need to put it inside so tire width times the times the aspect ratio plus 2540 times the wheel diameter divided by 10 million then after we need to print the approximate volume into two decimals to two decimals so how do we write it so print the approximate the approximate submit volume is so we need to write it into two decimals so two float okay one liters okay and then that format tire volume okay so we are done with our displaying the approximate volume into two decimals. Need is next is we need to get the current date. Current date. So how do we get the current date? So we just need to declare the current date variable. Date equals the date time that date that today. So we did this, we did this because we already import the date time so this is why we really need to have the um, import so you should know how to import the, the python libraries so that you will know how to maximize your code or make it short <coughs> next is we need to open file a file for appending so we will now put the data into text file so with so we need to with okay open so this is the code on how to open the text file so we have the volumes that text then a a as f then we need to if that we need to write write data to the file so we need to put the if that right okay then this one then then so it's about five i think one two three four five because we have the five which is the current date the tire width like this one okay this one the current date tire width um the re aspect ratio of the tire the diameter then the volume the volume calculation or, or the volume result next we will have the one two three four five yes then that format that format then what we will be having this is we need to display the current date i need to get the current date then tire width next will be the aspect ratio As after the aspect ratio we need to get the well diameter then the last is the tire volume which we need to round into two so tire volume Gamato. So having this code, we will now be able to um, run it and test it.
so when we run to run the code okay so i need to close this one so we just need to use the terminal so run so python how to run this one is you need just need to python tire underscore volume volume dot py so we first we test it by having this data so run 1 8 5 50 and 14 so we have the width of 1 8 5 then okay so we need to put this one here so test So we need to have okay we just need to make it okay. okay so we need to first input is 185 then the aspect ratio is 50 then the will is how much 14 so once we're done so 14 1 4 okay uh -huh. so we have the error here i n t is okay not callable so we'll try to fix this code so i think i forgot to put the here the multiple multiplication so we need to multiply this one so once we try to save so we'll start again with the well, for example we need to get again the 185 then the 50 then the 14 so it displays that the approximate volume is 24 point Oh, 09 as what it should be in this um, output the approximate volume is 24.09 liters so we'll need to check so we use OBS code to open the volumes the text file and verify that the last line of text in file looks like this except that it will be different so once we open that volume text file it should show here right we have that 20 we have the date the width the aspect ratio, the wheel diameter, and the volume calculation of the tire. Next is we need, we just need to run again the code to test it, test it again with the second data. So we need the two, 205 for the um, tire, tire width. Then next is we need to have the 60 and 15. 60 for the aspect, aspect ratio, then 15 for the Will. So the approximate volume is 39.2. So what is the output? So the, appro the approximate volume is 39.92 liters. So we are doing it correctly. Then we use v VS code again to open the volumes the text file and verify that the last two lines of the text in the file look like this, except the date date will be different. Dates will be different. So once we are done, we will check the volume the text file and compare the two. So there is no line here. So what we should do is we just need to put the um, a slash okay here in this side we just need to put slash n I think we need to we forgot to put the slash n so it should be it should display in the next slide so well like this so once we run this code again so we need to put the 205 560 and 15 so 39.292 liters so once we have this one we should have this uh, file already so we just need to update this one we just need to put slash n on the last date or uh, last format of the file so again we have the we have to put the um, tire width aspect ratio wheel diameter and uh, the current date I mean tire width aspect ratio wheel diameter and the tire volume rounded into 2 so maybe that's all thank you